Hi guys, it's Blair. Thank y'all so much for coming back to my channel. Um, today I am doing a like twist and curl using the Dew products. Um, I've never used these products before, so I was extremely hyped to use them because first of all, can we talk about the packaging? So I have it right here behind me, if you can see, and like look at that, that's some beautiful packaging. So, so yeah. So basically, I did not get the shampoo, I didn't get the conditioner. Actually, my best friend brought me these products, which is amazing because she knows I love trying products all the time. So, um, I didn't get the, like, the cleansing part of it or the conditioning part, so I just used another shampoo by Miel, and I also used a, um, a deep conditioner by Talia Waji. So, the first thing you see me use is the Dew We Want Easy Texture Tamer. This is a leave-in conditioner and a smoothing lotion. It's anti-frizz, protects from heat tools, and it hydrates. Everyone who follows me already knows that I love Miel's leave-in conditioner. Um, so I kind of use that as a baseline of what I compare my other leave-in conditioners to. Straight off the grip, um, this product was like very, it wasn't thick, but it was like, creamy. I don't know what to compare it to, um, but when I put it on my hair, let's just say I was not expecting it to do what it did. So immediately it starts to melt straight into my hair and then it just like disappears. Most of the time I apply my leave-in conditioner when I'm in the shower. I did not do that for the purposes of this video. Would I purchase this specifically again? Probably not, just because I don't feel like it super duper moisturized my hair. So the next product that I used in this video is the Dew Cream. And this is made of coconut, it's made of rose water, vitamin E, avocado, and minoy. I love how they did that little acronym. That's so cute. So it says to apply to clean, wet or dry hair, and twist, coil, or shingle, allow hair to completely dry before separating curls. So in this video, you see I used it, like just like what they said. Um, I applied it to wet hair um, that already had the leave-in on. And of course, they're from the same line, so they work perfectly together. Um, I put that on my hair, and the first thing I also thought was like, ooh. So once again, I also <laughs> I compared this cream to my melanin hair care cream. So I put it on my hair, and it, it didn't melt, it went away. It did not give me like super duper definition when I applied it to my hair. So most of the time I typically do a mini twist out. Um, I didn't have time to do that last night, so I just did a twist and curl, and this is what came up of that. Um, most of the times I'm like more used to like super duper definition, and I feel like every time I try to stir, every time I try to stray away from using my main choice braid out glaze, my hair does not get as defined as it, what it could do. So my hair feels. It feels okay. Um, it doesn't feel like it's moisturized as what I thought it would do. Um, the frizz is definitely there. I thought that frizz wouldn't be there, but the frizz is definitely there. And the ends are like, you know, curly because of the rods. At first I was like, oh, I don't like how this is coming out, but I typically don't wear my hair like in like a little frizzy state like this. So I do like how it just made my hair like, not frizzy, but it made it, it made it have more volume on the first time. So that's the best thing about it. I'm definitely going to try to use this cream with my braid out glaze because that's just who I am. I can't help it. Um, so I thought I would repurchase this. So she also got me the Bonita Afro Balm. So it's like a lightweight texture cream. It's not nothing that's like super duper heavy. So I feel that I would use this if I was like retwisting my hair. I'm definitely going to retwist my hair tonight. So I'll probably use this just to see if it gives me a little more definition before I go to work tomorrow. So I didn't use this in the video, so don't look for this one, but I am going to try it tonight to see if it can help my hair. Um, these are my final results. I do feel like they could be way more defined than what they are. However, we're going to let it be for right now because I kind of like it. And y'all know, if y'all seen my mini twist video, you know how my hair looks when I do mini twists. And the definition is there, okay? It is completely there, not slacking at all, it's there. So this is like a different feel for me because my hair isn't like super duper defined, but I kind of like it. So um, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope that you guys like this video and stay tuned for a new video next week 
what will it be i don't know but um like always guys just like comment and subscribe and share with all your friends and thank you very much for watching this video and thank y'all for coming to beyond blair bye bye